the like icon. Here's my painting of Hero. Whoa, that's nice. How did yours turn out, Leo? Um... <laughs> it's a little abstract. Ranger Leo speaking. Oh, hi, Junior Ranger Jane. How's the zebra migration going? Have they found fresh grass? Hi, Leo. Hi, Katie. The zebras are still on the move, but a mother zebra has lost its baby in the herd. <gasps> oh, no! Luckily, I have a photo of it. Can you come over to help me find the baby? Of course, Jane. The photo will come in handy. Hang tight. We'll be right over. Cool. I'll send you my location. Ranger out. Ranger out. Now let's go. Let's find out more about zebras. And get away from this pesky fly. Here it is. The plains zebra. Plains zebras are the most common species of zebras. Zebras are part of the horse family and they are known for their black and white stripes. Every year, thousands of zebras migrate, traveling over great distances to look for food, like fresh grasses and water. Oh boy, that's a lot of them. And they all look the same. Actually, each zebra has a different stripe pattern. No two zebras have the same stripes. Like human fingerprints, its pattern is unique. So we just have to match the stripes. And since we have a picture of the baby zebra, it'll be a snap. Hmm, stripes and patterns? I think I'll bring our paint along, just in case. Good idea, Katie. Look at all those zebras. Hi, Jane. Hi, Zumi. Hi, Leo. Hi, Kitty. Don't worry, Mama Zebra. We'll find your baby. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, wow. That is a lot of stripes. Whoa, too many. Huh? Leo, are you okay? Oh, thanks, Katie. <laughs> the stripes are a little confusing. Hmm. Let's see what else we can find. Ouch! Not again! And I thought the fly in our backyard was bad. This fly is worse. It bites. I got it. It says here that scientists scan zebra stripes like barcodes to tell them apart. Uh-huh. So, we can do the same thing. I'll make a zebra stripe scanner. Got it. Now I just have to... Done! There is our scanner. Cool. You just have to aim it at a zebra. And it's a success if the stripes match. Aim at a zebra. Ugh, these pesky flies are getting in the way. Why aren't the flies bugging the zebras? Maybe it's because they've got stripes and you don't. <gasps> Ranger, Ranger Rocky! Rocky. What do you mean, Ranger Rocky? Not only do zebra stripes look cool, we're starting to find out that it could be pretty useful, too. Scientists think that one of its functions is to confuse insects like flies, making it harder for them to land on zebras. And if they can't land, they can't bite. Nifty, don't you think? I'll be buzzing off now. Bye, Bye Ranger Rocky. Rocky! How are we gonna get stripes, Katie? Oh, you'll see. This is so cool. It's a good thing you brought the paint over. Hopefully this will get those flies to buzz off. Now, let's get back to looking for the baby zebra. We'll have to scan every one of them. Katie, Hero, and I will use our jetpacks to get a better view. Jane, you brought your own ride? The baby's mother insisted. <laughs> Let's go, Rangers! Jetpack activate! What if we scanned all the zebras at once? I'll have to use your camera, Hero. It's scanning. Let's see if we can find a match this time. Oh, what's this? It's a match! We found the baby! Yes! <gasps> Leo, no! Oops! Stampede! Huh? Oh no! Jane, we've got trouble! 
I know. Can you get to the baby? I'm sending you its coordinates. We'll take care of the herd. Got it. Stop it! Calm down! There's nothing to be afraid of! Hang in there, little one! We can't keep this up much longer! We need something to stop these zebras! Something to stop them? Way to go, Zumi! you guys it'd be a snap well <laughs> kind of <laughs> <laughs> Ranger Jane, what's up? Hello, Leo. I found two baby elephants playing by their river. But one of them looks sad. Just look at this photo. What? A sad baby elephant? We can't have that. We need to turn that frown upside down. <laughs> Can you and Kitty come over to help me do that? Of course, Jane. We'll be there right away. Great. I'll send you my location. Ranger, out. There they are. Hi, Jane. Hi, Zumi. Hi, Leo. Hi, Katie. Are those the elephants, Jane? Yes, they are brothers. Their younger brother is the one that is upset. The younger brother kind of reminds me of you, Katie. Uh-huh. Oh, here they come. Hey there. Gee, thanks. Hi there. Nice to meet you. Huh? Oh no! Is there something wrong with his trunk? Yeah. Is that why he's sad? There's nothing wrong with it. <gasps> Ranger, Ranger Rocky. Rocky! Hello, Junior Rangers. Is that normal, Ranger Rocky? Well, it's not exactly normal, but he just doesn't know how to use his trunk yet. The younger elephant is sad because he's not as good as his brother. Then let's teach him how to use his trunk. What a lovely idea. Good luck with that, Junior Rangers. See you around. Bye, Bye Ranger, Ranger Rocky. Rocky. Curl, I'm Curl. Now it's your turn. You can do it. <gasps> do not give up. Whoa, nice work! Don't worry, you'll get there. I'm not giving up on you. Lesson two, sucking water. See that straw? Pretend it is your trunk. So, you just put your trunk in, suck up the water, not all the way. Now, hold it. Easy peasy. Go on, give it a try. Put your trunk in the water. Then suck. Aww. It's okay. Let's try again. Huh? Whoa, that's a lot of water. He's like a fountain. <gasps> Where are you going? Come back. I'm sure he didn't mean to upset his little brother. Let's go after him together to make sure he's okay. Okay, Leo. Let's go, Rangers! Over there! It's okay! Your brother knows he's wrong. We can help you with your trunk. Slow down! Huh? <gasps> oh no! Oh no! He is dropped! Hang on, we'll get you out! Jane, you stay here with Zumi to watch him. The rest of us will get Platypus One. Got it! Hang on tight! Pulling him out now! It's not working! The elephant's too heavy! Look! He managed to grab the rope! He's helping us! <gasps> oh no! <sighs> he is alright. Uh-oh. Platypus One is not powerful enough! 
What should we do now? Think, Leo, think. Huh? He's going to the river. He is soaking up water. But what's he doing with it? <gasps> How clever! It says here that elephants can swim. And? He knows we're not strong enough to pull his brother out. But if we fill the <gasps> hole with water, he can swim out of there. It's going to take forever to fill it up. We need more help. <laughs> Whoa. Amazing. What's going on? He called for backup. He's instructing <gasps> them. All right. It'll be filled with water in no time. Let's do this, Rangers. Jetpack activate. activate. Yes. All right. We did it. <laughs> you know, your little brother is the one who came up with the idea. We turned that frown upside down. Aw, they have to go now. Bye, Bye elephants! elephants! A sinking feeling. Ah! Quicksand! Whew! <gasps> oh no! More quicksand! Ah! All right, Farah, don't panic. In times like this, check the Junior Ranger Handbook. Quacking? No. Quails? Not quite. Where's quicksand? Huh? Two horns? You want me to hold your horns? All right. Uh, yeah. ah! Oof. Thank you, two-horned unicorn. Now, where's my... My handbook! No! Wait! My book! <gasps> my dirt bike! My book! My dirt bike! Leo, it's an emergency! I need help! What's wrong, Farah? Are you okay? I'm okay, but my dirt bike is not! It's stuck in quicksand! Quicksand? We'll be right over to help you get it out, Farah! Ranger, out! Let's go, Katie! Farah is trapped in the desert! She needs our help! You guys made it! Be careful, there's quicksand everywhere! What should we do now? Hmm... I got it! Activate your jetpacks, guys. I need you to attach the winch to Farah's dirt bike. On it. Jetpack activate. Done. Reversing now. My dirt bike. I thought I'd lost you. Thank you so much. No problem, Farah. Now I have to go get my handbook back. Your handbook? Yeah, the two-horn unicorn. You mean the Arabian Oryx. Oh, so that's what it is. The Arabian Oryx left with my handbook. It must be long gone by now. Don't worry, Farah. We'll help you get it back. Maybe Hero can find its scent. <laughs> and I'll scan the horizon with my binoculars. Nothing over here. Hmm, nothing over there. Wait, what's that? Huh? Ranger Rocky! Ranger Rocky? Hello, Junior Rangers! What are you Rangers doing in the middle of the desert? An Arabian Oryx ran off with Farah's handbook and we can't find it. Do you know anything that might help, Ranger Rocky? It is said that an Arabian oryx can smell rain from far away. Once it detects the scent of rain, it will travel towards it, in search of the fresh grass that grows because of the rainfall. Hmm, rainfall? I can check the weather on my tablet. Rain clouds are gathering over there! 
Then that must be where the Oryx is heading. Thanks, Ranger Rocky. Let's go. Wait for me, Handbook. I'm coming for you. Good luck, Junior Rangers. There's nothing to be afraid of. We just have to move very quietly. Ah! Wait a second. That sound, it's really familiar. It's no ghost. It's just someone's bed sheet. An, An Arabian, Arabian oryx. oryx. The sheet was caught in its horns. But where's my handbook? <gasps> Please don't tell me you ate it. <gasps> There's another one. Now, what do we have under here? My handbook! Be careful, Farah. I'll get it for you. Pardon me, Arabian Oryx. Just have to get this for my friend. Got it. Yay, my handbook! Thanks, guys! It looks like it's about to rain. Bye, Arabian Oryxes! Now let's get out of here before my handbook gets wet! Hit subscribe and click the like icon.